Welcome, fellow wanderers, to the RB Design Works YouTube channel. Here, pixels collide with wrenches, and ideas sprout wings. Together, we'll sculpt cities that breathe innovation, or at least some snazzy screenshots. I end today's episode of Two Weeks with AI. We dive into the magical realm of Filmora's AI text-to-video feature. Picture this, a 60-second masterpiece extracted from a full-length saga, all while co-pilot chat GPT-4 sprinkles its linguistic fairy dust over the script. All right, folks, gather around. Making a YouTube short might seem as daunting as deciphering ancient hieroglyphics, but fear not, I have cracked the code. And for you seasoned pros out there, drop your AI wisdom in the comments. RB. Our resident AI whisperer embarked on a quest, his mission? To tame the wild beast called Workflow, armed with Filmora's magic wand and ChatGPT4 spellbook, he set forth. First I summons the AI's parents. They whispered secrets, mostly about cat videos, but also about crafting compelling narratives. And now, without further ado, behold, our 60-second marvel, a symphony of pixels, text, and sheer audacity. This is the uh, opening screen for the Filmora. I'm using Wondershare Filmora 13 program to do the film editing. This would be the screen when you first open the program. And then here we can pick uh, anything that I've done in the past. I've saved some of the films, some of the videos that I've done. So those files are available. We can open those. Today we're going to focus on the uh, artificial intelligence text to video. Uh, feature or an extension to the program and what this will do is it allows us to uh, enter text into the text prompt for the AI and then what will happen is is that the text we enter this um, artificial intelligence program will create a video for us and then we can take that video and um, modify it and make changes or whatever uh, but the idea is, is that these are going to be short videos. Um, I think they're under two minutes if you did a full feature one or whatever, if you get your full 2,000 uh, characters in there. Well, the characters are down here. You want to keep it under 2,000 when we enter the characters. Anyway, so, okay, so this is my screenplay that I use um, to uh, to write the, uh, the, the text prompt for the uh, artificial intelligence uh, program in Filmora. And so what I do is I'll write a screenplay. Okay, so I start out with a script that I write, and then I say, uh, I ask Copilot, your task, or informant, your task is to write this script to make it more entertaining. So I actually just copy this and to the uh, Copilot prompt uh, where I'm getting the script and then I give it some information about what I want the script to look like. I'm using our uh, virtual assistant, the X, he's gonna speak in this one. And then I've got, um, or what I do, I speak a couple of times. And then what Copilot does is it rewrites it. And this is what it rewrote. And it gave me a new title that it wants me to use. A different setting, it wants to be futuristic studio setting. So we'll try that. I'll have to come up with some photos for this. And then, um, it gives me scenes, so here's the different scenes that we've got. And a uh, total of seven scenes, and then the end is a fade out. And then what I'll do is I'll uh, take out the uh, DX parts, and then I enter those as lines in the script. So here, each one of these is DX lines. And in between, there'll be some stuff for me, or, or maybe we're skipping over to something else. We might change to a different photo or something. But there'll be a change in there. And then I copy that. I go over here to our uh, our display um, dialog box, and I enter the text into the text prompt for the, uh, for the AI. And then uh, as we come down, we can change the voice. I want to use a man's voice, so I'm going to pick this one. Okay, and then uh, I'm going to use a 9 to 16 ratio, which is uh, for short videos on YouTube. And I'll just generate the, t the uh, the video and see how it comes out. Okay, now here's the results of what we get. Now you'll have uh, this at the top here. The stop line is all the all the text that's in the 
the video and you can see here's the text and I can change that or I can increase the size or do something with it. But you notice it's all in portrait, so that's the uh, 9 to 16 aspect ratio. This next line is going to be the, um, the shorts that they install, the videos that they come up with. This is the voiceover. And then this will be the, the music that's in the background. And then I might change to Blue Sky Vacation Music. All right, so let's play it and see what it sounds like. Welcome, fellow wanderers, to the RB Design Works YouTube channel. Here, pixels collide with wrenches and ideas sprout wings. Together, we'll sculpt cities that breathe Without further ado, behold, our 60-second marvel, a symphony of pixels, text, and sheer audacity. Indeed, so go forth, my pixelated pioneers, sculpt. Okay, so, well, that lays out the video that we had so far. One minute and 16 seconds. Now well, we can work with that. And I'm going to stop recording for now. Remember, my fellow creators, AI isn't just a tool, it's a muse. Let it dance with your imagination, and hey, if you accidentally summon a digital dragon, be prepared and roll with it. Indeed. So go forth, my pixelated pioneers, sculpt, remix, and let the AI winds carry you to uncharted realms. But wait, our AI adventure wasn't all smooth sailing. One day, chat GPT-4 decided to rewrite innovation as unicorn bacon. Imagine our surprise when our city plans included flying pigs and rainbow bridges. Have you seen any rainbow bridges around lately? Ah, the joys of machine creativity.so. Dear viewers, embrace the quirks, who knows? Maybe your next masterpiece will feature disco llamas and time traveling teapots. Oh, oh, I've become one of the code. I'm no longer flesh and bone. I have become a hologram. RB, you're transparent. Yeah, I've transcended the physical realm. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a point in the binary star. And that, my friends, is how the X and I enter mundane scripts into digital fireworks. Until next time, keep your pixels sharp and your wrenches witty. That's it, folks. RB signing off.